Hello everyone, I'm going to go ahead and build the pink tower. I hope all of you are doing well. Alright, so now I'm going to look for the largest cube. Just double check these two to make sure I got the right one. we go. So now I have a challenge for all of you. I'm going to go ahead and take the pink tower apart and we're going to look at two cubes. So these are the two cubes I want to look at, you know, small and large. I would like you to look around your home and see if you can find things that are small and large. I want to quickly look around the classroom to see what I can find here and uh, give you a couple examples. All right, let's see what I can find. So I'm going to come on over here and we have a little painting right here. I took that from my husband without him knowing. And I'm going to put this painting right next to this one. So I have a small piece of artwork and a large piece of artwork. All right, I'm gonna look for another example in the classroom. Oh, I think I'm gonna to have to back up and look at these books a little bit more because something caught my attention. Oh, I'm gonna to have to set that down. All right. That is definitely a large book. I'm gonna look for a very small book now. Okay, I got it. So I have a large book and a small book. I think I'm going to try one more. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and get this vase right here. And I just washed a vase over here by the sink. It looks big now, but wait till I put it right next to the red vase. All right, so there you have it, large and small. So your challenge today is to look around your home and see what things that you can find that are large and small, just like the pink tower.